Good morning. It is Sunday, August 23rd. I got up today, still not feeling the greatest. Um, but I did get plenty of good sleep, so definitely better than yesterday, and yesterday was better than the day before. Um, still have a bit of a stiff neck. Could be just still from several days in that terrible bed, or perhaps the roller coasters that I rode got to me more than I thought at the moment. Still, was glad to be able to ride them, and it wasn't too bad, but uh, maybe that has something to do with it. And that could be causing the headache that I also have, or could be allergies. So this morning I, I pulled all, like I have like, see like all the dirty laundry that I came back with from vacation that's on the floor, and I got it into the baskets. They have lids, so it's put away. In case it's just like pollen on the clothes that are sitting around has been making things worse or something. Because I had been outside for uh, a lot more than normal. And uh, allergies can bother me quite a bit. So I did some of that and I'm starting to feel better as the day is progressing. Uh, I chose to just stay home and watch church uh, on the computer. Uh, you know, obviously the reason we went on vacation is because we thought, you know, the, you know, risks, health risks were uh, reasonably low for us, given what's going on. Um, but that doesn't mean I'm going to pass my risk assessment to someone else. And I didn't want to wear a mask throughout the entire service today. I just wasn't, I've been having to wear the mask too much uh, on the trip. So I'm like, I'll just stay home. Because, <laughs> uh, I don't know, I just wouldn't feel right. You know, make it, you know, making that assumption for other people as far as, uh, I guess the risk we've taken. But still, um, I don't really know what, what's going on today. Probably need to do more editing. Beyond that, not really sure. Making more buffalo chicken dip uh, between working on some editing. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm glad for this. Feels like it's been months since I had the buffalo chicken dip. It's probably been like close to like a single month. But I did try and step away from it a little bit. There were I think at least two shopping trips where I deliberately said, no, no, let's not get the stuff for that again. Because I don't want to get burnt out on it. Because I, I can do that. I very frequently can eat foods repetitively until I'm burnt out. Not that I won't like them again later, but, I mean, hey, I used to get uh, Chinese food very frequently, and I did that until I get burnt out on it, and I've, I'm sure there's other things. But still, um, I mean, God. I've done that with even making the fried rice at home at one point, but still love some some buffalo chicken dip. Glad to have it again. So I've been working on editing some stuff. You know, I gotta keep getting that done and I had a message from mom. Ethan, and if you forgot his phone charging cord over here before they left on the trip. So, I was voluntold to come pick it up and bring it over to him. Fine. <laughs> uh, but I get here, and on the porch is a loot crate box. I'm like, loot crate box? Why would that be there? And I start thinking, and I'm like, oh, I, rem I think I remember. I know why that would be there. That would be, yeah. Whatever. There was some item in the last loot crate that I got that it was like, oh, this is missing. It'll come in the next crate. And we'll send it to you if you don't have one. So apparently if I don't have a next crate, they decided to wait several months. Four months? 
pie at least, uh, to send that my way. So a house, house ghost charm, like keychain. And after getting home, I just spent a couple hours more um, editing. Also, I mean slowly. I was also watching the uh, Dwarven Forge. Uh, did another stream showing off some of the stuff from the the Kickstarter, and, and I, I watched those, but having it sort of in a, a tab while also working on editing, because I uh, need, need, to, need to get through that. I'm working hard to get through that. It's like, yay, several fun days of vacation, and now I'm home in boring days, because <sighs> I want to get through it, and it's, like I had like 40 minutes of footage one day that I cut down in half, and I mean, it's things like, how much of the sunrise do I show? A lot of it, but not nine minutes of it that I had recorded. <laughs> That's just two minutes. That's enough sunrise for <laughs> uh, how much of a show, you know, whatever the show in Branson, the, the saloon show that I, I got to record. How much of that do I put on there? Well, quite, quite a little bit actually, because I want to select some highlights, try and say, hey, this is an awesome show, and it was hilarious. Um, but obviously, I don't, you know, that that is their material. I don't want to, you know, <laughs> basically try and make it where I have a good case for fair use if it comes up. Because, uh, so limiting how much I show was definitely on my mind with that. But still, all those... Considerations is just work that I'm putting in. And I'm making progress. I'm making pretty good progress. But, uh, it's getting late. I'm gonna just heat up some more of the buffalo chicken dip for dinner because it's delicious. Um, and I do have one more day of vacation tomorrow. Tomorrow is Monday, but I do not return to work. I do wake up at my normal work time, however. I have a dentist appointment in the morning, so it's not really vacation. I'd actually taken this, you know, the Monday off, like, a month at least before I took the rest of the vacation time off. It just happened to pair together with all of them. So I do have one more day off. So, dentist in the morning, and then I have the, the, the rest of the day free, so that'll still be nice. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat and get to bed, since I do still have to wake up bright and early for that. Thank you for joining me. Join me as my journey continues.